Hello, this is Richard from SmoothComp again. Welcome to another tutorial. And in this video, I'd like to show you our scheduling features. First, we go to brackets and schedule. Here you'll find three tabs, brackets, current matches and find matches. We're gonna be working from the brackets view. I have set up my mats and on mat two, I have three divisions. What we're going to do is we're going to move some of the fights in those divisions to our TV mat over here. I'll click one of the divisions. In this view, I have a button saying drag to select matches. So I will do that. I will drag and then I will select a couple of fights that I want to move to another mat. And now this box says add selected matches to new block. So I click here and then I choose TV mat. And after a couple of seconds, Smooth Comp has moved the fight to another mat and we now have two blocks. Green is matches that are still on its original mat and all the purple ones are the one that we moved. And we now have two blocks, green and purple, one and two. If I want to, I can rename the new block. Then I click edit and I might want to name it upper half of black 69 kilos. And then I click save. If I go back now to brackets and schedule, you will see that I have my original bracket here and then over here I have the upper half of black 69 kilos and as you can see if I hover over them it reflects on the other one so I know they are connected let's do that again with female gi adult in this division I will just move the final so I mark the final like that Add selected matches to the new block, TV mat, and there you have it. It's very fast. And now it says final. Going over here, I hover over the female gi adult class, and you can see over here it says final. If I for some reason change my mind and I don't want to split the final to the other mat, I can just go back and then I use the merge all blocks button. Merge and then everything is back to its original state. No more final here. I can also edit my schedule if I want to move one division from one mat to another or maybe change the order within the mat. To do that, I click edit schedule. And now I can reorder the divisions within the mat. I can move one division from one mat to another. And once I'm satisfied, I click save changes. SmoothComp automatically recalculates all the ETAs for each mat so that I know I have an even schedule so that my mats stop at the same time. So once you're done with all your bracketing, make sure to even out the mats so that you start and stop at the same time. We also have a feature where you can add a pause within a mat. To add a pause, then click Edit Schedule. And from here, you use this button. And there is two different ways to add a pause. So I name it, and then I assign it to one mat. Let's use mat number two as an example. I can either have my pause start just after one division is finished, and have the pause until a certain time like this or 
I can have a pause duration of maybe 30 minutes. So if I drag this pause here, once this division is finished, it will add a pause for 30 minutes and then start this division. We also have a feature to see more information about each bracket. It is called extended info. So if I click this button, you will see that all the brackets, they will show more information like this. It will show the time per match that I have set when I created the bracket. It will also show the estimated time for each bracket. We recommend to have one minute more than your actual fighting time. If you're a not so experienced organizer, maybe put two more minutes. So time per match would then be five and the estimated time would be seven. Once you get more familiar with Smooth Comp and your organizer skills grow, then you can have just one minute. You will also see the type of bracket that this is using. And this one is a double elimination with a double bronze bracket. And the total ETA of this bracket is 145 minutes. The ETA here for this bracket shows when it's set to start. So we're showing when each weight class is set to start. And we're also recalculating this after each match is saved. So times are dynamic and change during the day. We're also showing the number of matches scheduled for this mat and the ETA of when the mat is set to be finished. I hope you liked this video about our scheduling features. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel to see more videos and to reach the ultimate goal to become a smooth operator.